Alright, so we started off with this man Doomsday destroying the whole city. And the cops ended up pulling up. And while he was holding the cops, they showed this girl recording the whole thing. And this is the exact problem with our generation. Everybody want to go viral. She over here recording for some views. Little does she know this is a Thanos level threat. Me personally, I was running as far as I can. Doomsday eventually sees her recording. So he starts walking her down. But before he could get to her, Hawkman pulls up and starts hitting his ass across the whole city. Then he goes to check on Doomsday. But this nigga gets grabbed and slammed all over the place like how Broly did Goku. Then he picks him up with one hand and punches him in the sky just in time for Green Lantern to catch him. Then he brings him to safety. And Batman tries to tell him to go help the civilians. But he was not trying to do that shit. Green Lantern was like, Nah, yeah. I'ma do my own thing. So this nigga ended up pulling up on Doomsday all by himself. But this backfired badly because he got sent flying. Then Doomsday hits him with a Hulk smash. This man was beating Green Lantern ass so bad, bro went unconscious. Bro should have listened to Batman instead of trying to be the main character. And if you a Green Lantern fan, I feel bad for you. Because why is this man always taking L's in all the movies? Before Doomsday could finish Green Lantern, Flash pulls up and saves him. Then he picks up Hawkman's weapon and rushes in at Doomsday. And he giving this man Doomsday crazy work. Flash is literally hitting him with combos at every angle full speed. And all Doomsday could do is duck to the ground. But eventually he catches Flash lacking and one shots him. And this is when I knew Doomsday was a cheat code. He caught the fastest man in fiction. Hell nah. To the now, nah, nah. Hell to the now. As soon as Doomsday was about to finish Flash, Batman pulls up and hits him with some bombs. I need backup now. These weak ass gadgets ain't gonna do shit to bro. Batman starts making a run for it. And I can't really blame him because this guy's a human with no powers. One punch from Doomsday, they gonna have to take that nigga to the ER. We back to the fight and Batman is weaving midair. And Doomsday actually doesn't care because he's throwing anything he sees at Batman. This nigga literally threw a trail at Batman and dislocated his arm. I really want to know who gonna pay for all these damages. Doomsday starts rushing in, but Batman flips back and throws bombs at him. That shit ended up doing no type of damage. Who gonna tell Batman that his weak ass attacks only work on niggas like Joker and Bane? I thought it couldn't get no worse than this, but it did. Doomsday literally rips off Cyborg's right arm. Aquaman pulls up from behind and stabs him. Then they start double teaming him, but that shit does not work at all. Double teaming don't even work against this nigga. This man Doomsday is doing the Justice League worse than Broly was doing the Z Fighters. Him and Broly got one thing in common, no talking, just throw hands. Doomsday throws a truck at Batman and Cyborg tries to help him get away. But the truck hits the line and Batman ends up eating straight concrete. And this is over with, just take a look at the condition Cyborg and Batman is in. They look like they're the ones that just got jumped. But I do want to give Batman a little bit of credit because he lasted longer than Flash and Green Lantern and they got powers. Your contract is gone! Sizzling on fire, ripped in the fucking corners! Doomsday walks around looking for more people to violate. Wonder Woman pulls up and she called this man out for a one on one. She know her team weak, so she said, let me just ISO this shit. They rush in at each other and start throwing hands. We? And Wonder Woman hits him with a mean right, and that sent him flying back. And this is literally the first time Doomsday been hit the whole fight. Wonder Woman tries to jump on bro and he kicks her ass back. Then she throws Doomsday into a billboard and starts crashing out on him. But if you look at Doomsday, he not affected at all. She throwing pillow punches. So he just ends up throwing her ass into a building. And that made her hair come out the bun. So now she like, let me lock in. So when Doomsday rushes in at her, he throws a whole bunch of punches but hits nothing but the wall. Then she appears from behind and grabs him with the lasso. Then she starts swinging this nigga around and throws him into a moving truck. Why the fuck is somebody even on the road at this time? What was this person thinking? You you see them fighting what you were supposed to do is hit the meanest u-turn and get up out of there and this still didn't really do anything to doomsday it just made it worse because bro started crashing out throwing anything near him we but wonder woman we charges at him weaving the cars then she smashes him twice with it and i low-key thought she was cooking until she gets her face palmed in 
Then bro smashes her head first into the ground. And when she lands, she rushes back in. Just for her to get her sword broken in one punch. Then he knocks her the fuck out. And this is over. She cannot beat this man. This is equivalent to Isaiah Thomas playing Shaq 101. And you would think the fight's over because look at her condition. But Doomsday wasn't satisfied. He wanted more. So he jumps on her and starts throwing rights and lefts. As soon as he was about to finish her, guess who decided to pull up? Superman. And he gotta be L Man's of the Year, cause where was he at when he was fighting this universal threat? His ass picked the hoes before the bros and decided to go on a date with Lois. Doomsday and Superman start hitting a quick little face off, getting ready to box. They both rush in and start grabbing each other. And Doomsday shoots E Vision, sending Superman flying into an office. Superman better lock in, cause they got him on the news getting his ass beat. They eventually make it to a bridge and they have an all out brawl in this motherfucker. While Superman was trying to help this lady, Doomsday grabs this nigga by his head and starts slamming him over and over again. And he punches bro and back ends his ass. But Superman wasn't finna go out like that. So he started to lock in until Doomsday grabbed him and threw his ass twice. They both started going back and forth for a little while. One second Superman will get his hits in and one second Doomsday will get his hits in. And there's somebody recording in the back. I know TMZ gonna try to get their hands on this footage. Doomsday's over here stomping Superman out. So he has no choice but to tie him to the bridge. And he looking out of shape. Cause bro over here breathing heavy. Doomsday ends up escaping. And I don't know what's up with him and throwing stuff. But he throws a boat right at Superman. But Superman reverses it and sends it flying right back at him. Then he grabs a chunk of Doomsday's hair. And these niggas collapse through the whole bridge. This man launches Superman, then catches him mid-ear and smashes his ass. I ain't even know that was possible. I think this nigga's just trying shit at this point. Doomsday ends up realizing that there's a helicopter following them, so he picks Superman up and launches him at them. One of the people in there was Lois, and she low-key deserved that shit, because you see these two fighting and your ass still decide to follow. But anyway, Superman ended up saving the helicopter from crashing. Doomsday over here crashing out because bro still want his fade. So he jumps to the top of the building until Superman hits him with that Derek Jeter special. And they in the sky and they still running the fade while they're falling down. And they both started a meteor crash that destroyed damn near the whole city. And after that, Doomsday decided to go after Lois. And she has to have a death wish because why the fuck are you this close to the fight? There's no way this camera job is worth risking your life for. But anyways, this is where Lex Luthor pulls up trying to steal the show. And for some reason, he actually thought he was doing something. A few moments later. Get over here! Superman literally had to come over there and save this bald ass nigga. This man be saving everybody, but I'm not gonna lie, he gotta start saving himself. This man literally started getting the literal shit beat out of him. They got Doomsday looking like Gojo the way he walking Superman down. Now I want you to look at Superman fit. He done got his outfit turned into a crop top and shorts. And I want all the kids to close their eyes because Doomsday started bugging. This man threw Superman, grabbed him by his head, started choking him out, then arched his back. What type of freaky shit is this man on? Bro just made Superman a victim. Doomsday then turns his focus to Lois. And this nigga simp man was somehow able to gain enough strength for one more attack to break Doomsday's neck. And at the end, they both ended up getting packed up.